Hi, I'm Zach from Vanderhorn Dodge in Plymouth, Wisconsin. I'm here to quick show you how to access a spare tire on vehicles that have the spare tire rather than the patch kit. This is, uh, applies to Dodge Grand Caravans and uh, I believe also to Chrysler minivans as well. So right here, you're going to go in the back. This is the first step. You're going to take this off, twist these uh, little knobs so that they're in the unlock position. You'll be able to get this panel off. Behind the panel is going to be a couple of jet is uh, your jack assembly, which is going to be inside here. Also, what's going to be inside here is your lug nut wrench. See if it'll come out for us. See that there? And you can just pull this out, and you'll be able to get your tire off. The tricky part is getting to this to the tire. So we're going to show you this. If you want to go over the driver's side, I'll go run the passenger side. We'll take a look. The spare tire is actually located directly beneath my feet right now. In order to get to it, it's actually kind of interesting. I'm going to pull this little rubber liner is going to come out, both for easy cleaning and for this. Then I'm going to reach into the back and pull out the drawer that comes out here so that I can see all the way down in there. If you look down in there, you can see that little silver bolt down there. It's on the bottom. Now, what I do is I'm going to take these three items that came in a bag in the back there. I'm going to assemble them together. And you can see how everything kind of works together. I'm going to take this. And so now that's locked in there. I'm going to take this, I'm going to put this end down on the top of the bolt. That'll stick up like that. I'm going to take this T-handle, finish it off, and then I'm going to turn it to the left. And what this is going to do, this is actually going to loosen a wire that is holding that uh, tire into place. And then, once that tire is loose enough, you're going to need to turn this all the way until it stops moving. Because that will allow give you enough slack in that wire that's holding that spare tire into place so that you can actually pull it out with this, actually. You can grab it and just kind of pull it out and hook this over the edge of the tire and just kind of pull it out. And uh, remember, the full, you're going to want to get that, of course, get that full-sized uh, tire back on there as soon as you can stop driving the spare, the better. Um, as far as actually uh, getting the vehicle off, there are two jack points underneath the vehicle, underneath the sill plate, but you can put anything, you can put on any metal part of the frame. It's just the sill plates are built to handle the jacks. It's not gonna um, damage the frame if you leave it on there long term. Um, you, and then you use that lug wrench. We're gonna take a look at the tire real quick. Front tire. Move this out of the way. You're going to take off the lug nuts, you're going to jack up the vehicle somewhere close to the door sill plate, you're going to unlo uh, take off the lug nuts, all five here, put your spare tire on, tighten them all down as tight as you possibly can, use all your weight, do not want to have any of those babies coming off, and then you're going to put the spare tire in the trunk, don't try to mount the spare tire back onto that uh, assembly under that you need there. So. That's uh, how to uh, change a spare tire on uh, vehicles on Dodge Grand Caravans or Chrysler Town Countries that are equipped with it. Uh, hopefully this helped you and hopefully this uh, gets you all, uh, moving again. And uh, thank you for watching. Uh, let us know if this vehicle or this video really did help you. So anyway, thank you. Zach from Van Orn Dodge.